not a game, it's a rich thing. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a first impressions on Briogeo. So we're going to get started with wash day. I'm doing a wash and go and I've actually filmed this back in the summertime. I'm just getting around to posting it. So um, first we're starting with the Scalp Revival Charcoal and Coconut Oil Micro Exfoliating Shampoo. I was not expecting the lather of this. I was expecting to be like a no suds type of shampoo because of the texture of it, which was surprising. And the exfoliating part, the particles are really, really fine. So you really don't feel them. They're not abrasive on your scalp at all. It just feels really relaxing and soothing. And it feels like it really is cleansing your scalp. I really did like the shampoo. Um, a little bit about Briogeo. It is a black owned business. It's like a luxury black owned business where that can be found in Sephora. I was curious about the brand and I picked up a couple items. I really wanted to try their deep conditioner. I think is don't um, despair repair but it was out of stock so I picked up three items you're going to be seeing in today's video so I first impression of the shampoo I really liked it it really got my hair nice and clean and didn't dry it out my scalp felt really clean and refreshed really nice shampoo I really really love it so I would highly recommend as you can see my hair right there after rinsing it out I only washed my hair once normally I wash it twice but just for the purposes of it being exfoliating shampoo I didn't want to you know, be too abrasive on my scalp. So I only washed my hair once, but the results, I really, really loved it. So I highly recommend this shampoo. Um, I was only able to get my hands on the small one ounce size. I know this comes in a bigger size, but this is what I was able to get my hands on at the time when I did order these products. So I had to use a different deep conditioner um, with this <laughs> with this line because I wanted the one, but as I stated, it was out of stock. So we're going to move on to styling. So this is my hair a little bit air dried and we're going to go in with the Curl Charisma Rice Amino and Avocado Leave-In Defining Cream. This has like a kind of silky lotion texture. It smells pretty good. And you know I normally apply my leave-in in the shower and let it sit in my hair but just for filming purposes I applied it after I washed my hair in deep condition and this instant definition with my curls I really loved it. Um, this is infused with rice amino acids, avocado oil, quinoa extract, and tomato fruit ferment extract to enhance moisture and definition for soft, bouncy, vibrant curls. And it actually did that. My hair was really soft. It was defined as you can see how my curls were popping as I just applied just that. I could have left it alone, but I wanted to try the other product um, from the Curl Charisma line along with this. So I'm loving how my curls are looking so far. So now we're gonna go in with the Chia and Flaxseed coil custard. I was expecting a more custard texture but it felt like a thick butter. It wasn't too thick but it felt like thick and silky like a butter and these two products together really gave me defined curls when my hair was damp but it was a different story when my hair air dried. You'll see later on in the video how my hair looked but so far so good. I really like both these products especially this coil custard. It was very moisturizing. I love the texture of it. Um, it's a thick, rich, and creamy moisturizing styler that harnesses the conditioning benefits of flaxseed oil, shea butter, and coil nurturing power of chia seed and rice amino acids. This complex, The complex of rich moisturizers leaves even the driest of coils soft and supple while enhancing definition and providing flexible styling control, which this really did. As you can see, my curls with both products applied. So you just want to continue applying the leave-in and the curl custard and you're going to see in a moment what they started to do which I didn't notice in the back of my hair as I was styling my hair. As you can see I'm done the back. You'll see in a moment I noticed like these dry flakes and the flakiness and I was a little worried that it was going to stay and I was going to be in my hair but you'll see later on it didn't dry like that but that did concern me a little bit I don't know if I use too much product or what happens so if you do pick up these products be careful when you do apply to your hair you can experience that white flakiness but it does go away so we are all done I'm going to let my hair air dry and you'll see the results in a moment loving the definition and volume this is my hair when it's air dried. I liked it. It was okay. I've had better definition with products. I mean, I liked it for the moment. My hair was soft. It was defined. It was moisturized, but I just wasn't too happy with the results in a way. Um, but I did like the products. 
So if you're interested in trying out Briogeo, you can check them out on Sephora. Um, just for me, the first impressions, it was okay. I like the shampoo more than the stylers. So that is it for this tutorial. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Let me know down in the comments if you tried Briogeo before. And until next time, I will catch you in the next video.